You guys wanted to know the story about how we got engaged without going on a single date. Here it goes. Guys are going to think we're crazy. Okay, <laughs> Maybe so... Maybe we are. <laughs> so we met while serving missions for our church. And ironically, we were both sent, although from completely other sides of the world, we were both sent to the same state in America. So in April 2016, we met each other. But on a mission, you really just focus on the work that you're doing. You cannot have relationships. You don't even have your own cell phone or anything. <sighs> and you're constantly surrounded with other people. So we got to know each other very well. Our personalities were very similar. We were good friends, but there was definitely some chemistry. Yeah, there's definitely something there. So I went home from my mission in November of 2016. And then he finished his mission in February of 2017. And my parents wanted to come out and meet me there to like see where I was and meet people. And we thought, instead of me traveling clear to Ireland and trying to see if there's some chemistry there, because we can finally kind of explore that, Cam thought it was a good idea. Why don't you come just a couple states away from you and meet my parents and we can get to know each other and kind of see if we can have a relationship. So anyway, on this three day trip, we have our first kiss. And again, we never went on a date. We were never alone. So that was in front of people. Comment below if you want to hear the first kiss story as well. So every dinner, every hangout for those few days, we were with our parents and several other people. But the chemistry was there. But when you know, you know. We just knew. So I was going back to Ireland and we had agreed that I would come back and visit Caitlin soon, but we didn't know when. Little did she know that I was coming back in two weeks. It was already all organized. And in those two weeks while back in Ireland, I called her dad, got his blessing, bought a ring and flew back to America two weeks later and surprised her. She had no idea I was coming. So you can only imagine, I'm back in my hometown. I'm thinking, I might not see him for quite a few months. He shows up at my house one <laughs> evening, two weeks after I've just seen him, and my family had already had a cruise planned. Little did I know, my parents booked him to go on that cruise. And on that cruise, he proposed. It was all part of the plan. <laughs> the master plan. But it was just absolutely a whirlwind romance but we knew each other remember since april 2016 and then he proposed in march of 2017 so we knew each other for almost a year so the proposal in itself is a whole other story time so comment below <laughs> if you want to hear that story as well anyway that's how we met and that's how we were engaged without one single date when you know you know